wonderful, wonderful optic star. AR19S 90mm F ratio 5.5 Acromat. This is a Chinese telescope and uh, for the price you cannot get anything better. It's 90mm. It's for wild field practically observation of the night sky. So for planetary it's not useful. You can see some details but not like a planet killer, like a telescope with a high F number. But what a wonderful thing for wild field. The build quality is like a Takashi. Uh -huh. Um, optically, I don't think it's a Takashi, but build quality is really good. Mechanically, is really good. And I'm using a, a University Optics uh, Koenig 2 32mm eyepiece. Looking at the M15, I think, the Pegasus globular cluster. Beautiful, wide, very wide angle. Using the Skywatch in Nirvana 16mm, I can see the central part of the uh, M15, the globular cluster, brighter, halo, dimmer. Can I see any individual stars? So that's out of question. And now I'm using the Teleview Ethos uh, 8mm, 100 degrees. And the clouds and uh, this light pollution is not on my side, so I'm not seeing any individual stars, just a patch of the bright patch of the cluster looks bigger compared to the Nirvana 82 degrees film of view. Oh, hallelujah! With averted vision, and I can see some clumps of the some knots of the stars uh, gathering, small clumps. I don't think they're individual stars, but I can see a clump of uh, several stars close together in the M15 globular cluster. So not bad, not bad. If I, I ideal condition, probably I could see more. Also, if if I could sit. This is an amazing telescope. Using it, I felt I'm using it at Sonian. Really wild filled telescope. Of course, I was using it on the altar separate mount. And uh, the skull was extension column. And the Celestron XLT EQ3 tripod takes everything. Uh, Sabra didn't have the counterweight shaft, so I just used the uh, bar without actually any screw and these are the sha uh, con and the counterweight uh, weights for the EQ3 here fantastic telescope for under 200 pound and 
And when the dust cap goes in, it's so short. Yeah, 50 centimeter. And the telescope front cover is metal, also screwing. So you have to screw it in. I just see when I screw what will happen. comes exactly flat and it is tightened horizontal that's one of the qualities that the Questar they say had at the cap in a position if it is original cap of the telescope if we come always horizontal in the tightest position <laughs> 